Hello. Hello. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh my days. I um I Mark, come request again. We're starting there. I sent you a request. <laughs> hey, listen. I don't even need to talk on what's happening tonight, but Everyone. <sighs> Just retweet this space. Tweet all your thoughts on a hashtag. Yeah? And follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Car, shit finna be brazy. Tweet all your thoughts on a hashtag, my people. Yes, yes. Tweet all your <laughs> tweet all your thoughts on a hashtag, innit? Ra, man went to change the <laughs> this guy. Alright, boom. Listen, guys. You man know what's gonna happen tonight. Yeah. So please just follow me on my Twitter. Follow me on my Instagram, follow me on my TikTok, and subscribe to my YouTube page. Um, you're going to be seeing a lot of big surprises now. We're branching out now. You're going to be seeing the real as, yeah? So, just keep retweeting the space. Tweet all your thoughts on the hashtag. Um, all your questions, all your uh, opinions, tweet it on the hashtag or DM me. I'll read them out. Or if you want to come on stage, DM me as well, and then I'll 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 chat to you and I'll let you on stage. But listen, you man know what's gonna happen tonight. You man are all here for one reason, one reason only. Yeah, a lot of things have been said in the last couple of months. Yeah, a lot of things have been in the news. A lot of things have been published here and there. A lot of narratives have been pushed, 
and um, certain men, a lot of their voices and their stages have been taken away from them. But you know what? We're going to hear the harsh reality tonight. Yeah? We're going to get into the nitty gritty. So, guys, tonight is going to be a triggering space. Yeah? So, actually, let me add that on the title before people want to fucking get onto me again. Yeah? It's going to be a triggering space. So, guys, we have now entered a triggering space. Yeah? We're in a triggering space right now. Look, look. I'm in a triggering space. Yeah? So, if you feel offended, please exit right now. Don't want to hear no complaints. Ain't no complaints. Drake ain't no complaints. Metro Boomin. Offset ain't no complaints. Yeah, I ain't trying to hear no complaints. Please, because there ain't no complaints. There can't be no complaints. It's a trigger warning that I've added right now. If you feel as if you would be affected by the topic spoken tonight, then please, I will also advise you to contact certain charities and helplines that would be able to help you. If you feel some sort of way or you feel affected of what is going to be said tonight, then please, I will also add certain charities and certain helplines where you can go and speak to. But if you feel triggered, please, respectfully, exit the space. Car, it's finna get techie. All you men are here for one reason, and we're gonna get down to the nitty gritty. The truth is coming out tonight. So, guys, we're gonna start right now. Retweet this space. Tweet all your thoughts on a hashtag. And follow me on Twitter and Instagram, TikTok, and subscribe to my YouTube. Because we're gonna start right now. Yes, so guys, tonight we're here with the one and only Mark Cuban. I'm pretty sure everyone in here knows who Mark Cuban is. I don't even need to introduce him. I'm pretty sure. You know what, Mark, please introduce yourself to the listeners right now, please. Let them know who you are. Yeah, I know what's... they do already, but. <laughs> what's good? You good? Yes, yes, me, huh? yes, yes. Man can hear you still. Yeah, man, That's I'm good. doing good, man. Hey, Mark. Mm. Mark, hey, I'm doing good. I know it's been quite a while since we spoke last time. Mm. But, um, yeah, man, how's life been for you, man? How's life going for you right now? Life is good. Life is good. Can't complain. Um, yeah, inshallah, man. You know, we're good. Okay, okay, cool. Guys, everyone, tweet all your thoughts and questions on the hashtag, retweet this space, and also follow me on all my socials. All right, so cool, Mark. Basically, so the last time we spoke, obviously, you've been in the news, you've been in the media, um, a lot of um, accusations, wild accusations have been brought to your name. Key um, point, wild, wild. Keep wild, wild. You know, quite wild accusations um, mm-hmm. uh, from a variety of women. Um, and no, 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 no. It's selective, spoke, it's selective, not variety. Well, well, selective. well so selective, but they claim there's a variety. They claim oh, okay. there's a variety. But I oh, know okay. from the last time we spoke, we spoke mm. on the UK entertainment industry, obviously, which you're mm. in, where you mm. gained your popularity. 
um, and we spoke about your opinions on how the scene is, um, you know, how it can mm. improve and where it's mm. at right now. Um, mm. Obviously, I've, we've all seen that, you know, you ain't really been in the spotlight, let's say, mm. on YouTube. You ain't really, be, you ain't really been on major platforms. Um, that mm. chat, you ain't really been on there. Um, we ain't really seen much of you. Why is that? Bro, listen, you see, that chat, I'm not on it because that, that, is that show still going? I think it's dead now. Um, you have to spin around. I've not been around because I've kind of been sorting shit out. You understand? Um, and what I mean by sorting shit out is when people make statements, you understand? You have mm. to be very, very careful with what you make. Um, let me not even front and act like as if to say when I heard this, it wasn't a shock. It was a shock. Because, you know, when people sit there, go to studios in your bits, in your area, uh, and I wish I knew it was in my I wish it was in the studio that I know it to now be in on that mm. day because it would have been mad. They wouldn't have been able to film. I put on my mum's life. Mm. They would have not been able to film. That whole shit would have got locked off. Um, so it was mad because it was like, it was only recent times when I was even doing certain things in the studio myself. That I, you know, I just kind of clocked something and I was like, wait, hold on. Ain't this the little scene? Mm. I was thinking, you, you know, you cheap fucker. You couldn't even do it. You were so like, ah, oh, I don't even want to get too... Let me not derail too much, but yeah, I was literally took time out because I wanted to do things properly. I don't mm. talk. I don't follow the way... I don't follow trends. I don't follow the way people do things in this country. Everyone just talks shit and don't realise that this is real life. There is nobody on li in life that is going to talk shit about me and not get touched. You talk shit about me, I'll fuck you up in your pockets. It's that simple. If you're a man, <laughs> if you're a guy... <laughs> listen, 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 hold on. It's not even a laughing matter. Listen, bro, because... I know what I've gone through. Okay. If you're a guy, you're not talking shit about me on social media. And when you see me, you're not going to have that same energy. Because I'll take you out. It's just that simple. I'm not a bad man. I'm not a gangster. I'm just me. If you know me and you know what I'm about, as do your research. It's not this mm. long. It's long. Nah, because the thing is, Mark, I've done my research on you. And I've spoken to you for quite a while now. And from what people are telling me, I've heard that you're a bit of a you're a bit of a nutter, like you're a bit of a hothead. Bro, it's not even just about a hothead. I'm like any other dude. You don't there's certain things you just don't touch. You understand? And um it's not even about a hothead, I just get shit done in it. Don't be I'm not a pussy. Let's pull it let's pull it like this, I'm not a pussy. Simple. You ain't a punk. You ain't a definitely, punk. Definitely, definitely not a punk. Definitely not a punk. Trust me. Mm. Mm. All right, cool. So, I'm going to ask you this then. What is your opinion on domestic uh, domestic violence? Bro, I don't fuck, I don't fuck with domestic violence. I have way. No one should be touching anybody. Do you understand? No woman should be touching no man. No man should be touching no woman. Do you understand? And if it's a situation where someone's getting touched, go about the right way. There's the police. Go to the police. Do you understand? File a report. Take that person to court. Um, get her. What's the, what's, the, what's the thing called again? Um... A non-molestation non order. Get one of them. Build up a case. Get your reference numbers. Make sure you've got all of that intact. Do you understand? Police will kick off your door. There's, nobody should be touching anybody. This shit's real. Do you understand? It's not, it's, not, it's not fun and tells and I'm going to say this because I want to sound cool. Fuck off. If that shit is real, get the proper help that you need. Hmm. Okay, but obviously, with the, you, I, I hear you are saying that, but there's three women who have bro, I don't they, care. Listen, listen, made wild accusations about yo, 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 about... yo. See, see, see the three women, yeah? Mm. My question is very, very simple. And at the time, I didn't say nothing because you see people, when they think they know, like, let me, let's just speak on facts. People in this social media in the UK are so... They're so uneducated. uneducated. They don't really know what they're saying. But did you do it, though? Did you hit any of them? Bruv, why am I not locked up? I didn't hit nobody. If, if I hit someone, why am I not locked up? But why there are people that do commit those type of crimes and they get away with it. You know what I mean? Oh, that's good for them. I'm not that guy. Mm. If, if, I, if I hit someone, why have police not come to my door? Not once, not twice. Mm. No, no, because I know I remember um, 
Lani, she put out a post taking a picture of a policeman. Yo, in yo, yo, house. if police, listen, let me tell you. And, and I don't Esther, really want to talk on Lani. You know, I don't want to talk on Lani. No, no, Lani. no, I know, I know, I know. But Esther, she also said something about, oh, uh, you can't scare me. Stop sending me all this paperwork. Oh, well, pause, 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 about... pause, 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 pause. Let me address that situation very, very quickly. Okay, you know what? Before you address that, mm. Esther said that apparently you was on the Claire's list. Bro, where is this list from? We would have to be in a... Like, like where? Where are you getting so, this information from? So, I just from? want to ask you then, because obviously, uh, Lani's mm. taking pictures and she's... From Bro, the anyone can take pictures. I know, anyone? I know, I know. But mm. from, from what she's trying to show, it's mm. as if she's made a police co- a, a complaint to the police. All right, cool. Can yeah. I say something to you Esther, now? Man? Esther mm. is also saying that you're on the Claire's list and so and so and so. No, it's, has it's called anyone, Claire's Law. Claire's Law. Has, Claire's okay, law. Claire's Law. On mm. the Claire's Law. Mm. Has any... Has, have the feds been in contact with you? Has, no, has there bro, been any no. letters, any visits, bro, any phone listen, calls? Listen, listen, listen. You see, after this conversation, I will put my address on public. I will do it myself. Come to no, my you, don't, you don't need to do that. No, 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 no. You don't have to do that so you don't get into no legal technicalities. Yeah? Let me, I'll put it out. Yeah? I, in, I, I welcome the police. Please come. Come to my house. Put cuffs on me. Let's go to court together. Investigate me. You'll find out there's nothing to investigate about. The question, I don't really want to chat on Lani because Lani's not even worth me chatting about. Do you understand? I'm mm. not here to intimidate nobody. I don't intimidate probably. I don't, I'm a, I'm a normal guy. You see the whole Esther thing about, what was it that you said? That she said that I should stop contacting her. Bro, mm. show the fact, show the evidence of me contacting you. The only person that contacted you was my lawyer. I don't, Talk to people when I don't need to talk to people. Mm. Do you understand? Oh, yeah, let me even correct something about the spelling today. You know the ones where you just got jittery fingers? No, nah, the spelling, the spelling. We'll, we'll it was atrocious. It was atrocious. We'll, but you know nah, what it is? No. We'll, I don't want we'll, people to... We'll address I don't want that people, later on. We'll although, I, don't want people, on. I don't want people thinking that there I'm some dumb dumb. I know, but... I know. Come on, we <laughs> listen. Come on, man. Mm, but mm, I, mm. I'm going to ask you this, isn't it? Mm. Now, with this whole situation, yeah, because obviously when they've gone on the show... Yeah. I think there's something going on saying that this show was even filmed like a whole year before. Bro, um, me, and me listen. That out now. Okay, so cool. I just want to ask, when did this all take place? Because I'm hearing apparently it was like four years ago. Time scales are a bit mad because bro, I've moved on. You know what I'm doing. Everyone that knows me close knows what I'm on. Yeah. Um, when I was talking to these individuals, it must have been about 2019. 18, 19, I can't remember, t- probably leaking into the late of ni- 2019s. So, yeah. and then when they dropped it, they dropped it last year because it's content, it's content, content, dickhead. Um, so, you're saying they filmed it in 2019? No, no, they filmed it. Or when lockdown. it happened, it they was filmed in it in lockdown. When the, This is why people are dumb. You, black people, you know, black people, we let ourselves down, man. Like, you filmed this last year. Well, we're supposed to be in lockdown restrictions. Not that I give a fuck, yeah? You filmed it in a studio where that if if my guy, who I know that runs that studio, had hollered at me, it would have been so long for you. So long, yeah? You filmed after hours where nobody could get a hold of you. Do you understand? Inshallah, like, you, you're just lucky, bruv. Like, like, when I'm saying I'm l- lucky, I'm not threatening nobody. What I'm trying to say is it will never have happened. Even when I got wind of when it happened, yeah? Time after it. I'm not going to mention nobody's name because I'm not trying to bring nobody. If I'm smoking someone, I'll smoke someone myself. When I got a phone call about this in this, this situation now, no, first of all, most I saw a trailer. I said, look at mm. these, look at these clowns. The only person, to be fair, let me be real with you, yeah? I don't have no malice to certain individuals. Who I've really got smoke for, she knows who she is, isn't it? Because she's such a clout chaser. You understand? <laughs> Such a clout chaser, telling people, oh, these idiots going to dust us in my face. Why have police not come to my door? You spoke about going to will, um, women's charities, you donut. You didn't do none of that. You're wasting people's time talking about UK gossip, how they try to help you. Bro, shut your mouth. Nobody, tra- listen, you, you went and sat in the park like some lunar. You live with your mum. Yeah? Stop <coughs> acting like I kidnapped you, bruv. I told you to come in the house because you owed me some peas. You're there putting them, sitting there trying to act like some sad girl, oh, crying your fake crocodile tears, bruv. Everybody saw through your cap, you cap. 
you cat for everybody. You're in every guy's DMs trying to be famous. Bro, no, because I heard something about what, because what, is this Bianca that you're talking about? No, you say names, I'll just say what I need to say. Okay, because mm. I heard, even with that Bianca girl, I heard something about she tried to accuse uh, uh, another big celebrity on Oh, on, on, yeah, yeah, on yeah, yeah, yeah. sexual indecency. Yeah, she did, but I'm never going to bring that to, to, to light. If that person... Now, that obviously, person... we don't know if that's true or not, but... Well, I can I confirm. I can confirm. Fight. Listen, no, 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 we don't know. It's not about if you know it's true. I can confirm, single-handedly, my whole chest, my whole bloodline, that is what she said. She said that the dude even gave her £100... To make her feel nice. She's a donut. 100 pounds. <laughs> She's so cheap. Yeah. Yo. So hungry. But the girl's a set up chick, bruv. I've got... Bruv, let me not even say... You know when people are sending out emails and people... People should remember. Girls keep receipts. But so do dudes. Mm. I've got receipts on receipts, boy. I've got heat for days. <laughs> heat for days. Like, I could drop mixtape after mixtape after mixtape. But the thing is, when guys over here start doing stuff like that, we get seen as like punk boys or bitch boys. But the problem is, is certain girls, and it's not all women, certain girls need to be exposed for who they really, really are. Mm. You're a clout chaser. Sending nudes. Like that whole nude situation, bruv, I know what I said in it. I know, I know what I said to the individual. I said, I never leaked no nude. Brother, I'm a big ass man. I've got, I've like, it's, you, like, no disrespect. I'm not even trying to dumb myself up. I've been with girls in my life and I've seen things. Why would I, at this big of age, be, oh, yeah, look at this nude? Am I a dickhead? For what? Am I a prick? Why am I showing the next? This girl said it herself that she went to go and show her next man, dude. And you know how that happened? She was like, mm. You see, with me, sometimes I'm a bit too open, innit, at times. And then, uh, yeah, you know, sometimes it'll come and ban me. This girl was threatening me. And I'm going to put this in the conversation in a bit for you to put up in the chat. So, mm. oh, I'm going to done you. I'm going to bury you. Brother, lock this thing off. Mm. She was on Hinge, using Hinge as a, as, a, as a network service for, oh, yeah, guys, take 100, I've charged guys 100 pounds for my number. Brother, go on, go on, made you think. Go on, Shade Borough. She's in all the comments. She's always trying to play this G that she is. Bruv, you're not no G. I've got video footage of you, me trying to kick you out of a club, and you was there trying to come at man. And I videoed you. And your two bedrooms had to hold you back. Mothers tell me I'm lying. I'll just pull it out there. Do you understand? <laughs> oh, Lord. Do you understand? But what it is, mm. is like, I'm not trying to shame nobody. But fam, what you have to understand is, you know what? I, I'm even, let me even take it down at all. What you have to understand is, when certain individuals come and start talking shit about you, you have to think to yourself, really? Like, what is clout that much of a drug? Like, are you ready to lose it all? Bro, I used to take this girl strip clubs. I've taken this girl strip clubs. She's been with me. She was taking drinks off other niggas. Put, you know when girls put the whole bottle in their mouth? I'm like, yo, where's your home training? Do you understand? Mm -hmm. She, she 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 talks about niggas wild, but she yet she goes to their raves. I'm like I'm like I'm just like yo, what are you on? She set up certain guys around me, and I, if you know what I'm about, you know what I'm about. All I have to say mm. is sorry, keys. If she's listening, all I have to say is sorry, keys, and the rest is history, my G. Mm. She knows what she did. The day mm. when I when I rolled up to her house, and she was on talking crap. She was like, oh, I'm, I'm at home. I said, like, yeah, just come outside. My mom wants to chat to you. Don't get it twisted. Everyone shout, whoa, what relationship is there in the world where you don't hear a couple exchanging pleasantries? Mm. Or should I play the voice notes of her going mad? Sounding like some psycho? What does it benefit me? Anyone can play a voice note of me going nuts. There's things, bro, like... Uh, Nobody is safe today, bro. I'm not even finished yet because what I did today is just the beginning. Mm. It's just the beginning. Don't play with me. You see what where I really went left, and I'll be honest with you, is when certain individual put my, my name on there, but you didn't spell my surname correctly, so it doesn't bother me. Yeah. The only reason it bothered me is this. 
One of my businesses is registered to my mum's yard. Do you get it? Mm. And my mum was getting death letters, bruv. Mm. Do you understand? I've shown I've shown you them. You don't even need to confirm it so you know that I've seen, I'm not them, I've seen them. Yeah, no, I've seen them. So, bro, when you start talking like that, bro, I'll, I'll, you will definitely unleash a next kind of monster inside of me. I know, listen from your burner account, listen from every account. Nothing I'm saying today is going to get me in trouble because it's all facts. I will do my homework before I come and do my practical. You're not going to catch me slipping. No way. Mm. Okay, so when everything happened, right, mm. and you saw everything that was going on, mm. what actions did you take? What was your next steps? Well, when they started doing all this flipping blue therapy or whatever they called themselves. No, no, sorry, my bad. Um, full disclosure. Bro, I just, called, I just called my lawyer straight away. I was just like, what's all this? Mm. I kept quiet because... What, what am I going to do? Start arguing with girls on the internet? Like, idiot. Yeah, I never did that. Who the fuck is anybody on the internet for me to be justifying myself to? No, they're lying. <laughs> what? Bruv, use your common sense. I called my lawyer. I said, yo, have you seen this? No, I haven't. I went to the office the next day. Boom, boom, boom. Certain things were taken. Screenshots. You know how it goes. We live in a modern day of technology. It's not hard to find anything. And I know what I did, bro. I don't, I'm not like, like I said, I know how I went about it. And the first thing they did was we did a background check on all the individuals involved. Mm. And my, oh my, was it a tasty day in the park? Mm. And then we did what we needed to do. And um, first of all, most, I sent a cease and desist letter, which is, yo, you're talking a bit of cap now. You need to relax. Do you understand? Then that's when a certain individual goes, oh, oh my God, you can send me all the letters you want. I, I'm not going to stop. Stop contacting me. I never contacted so that you. So that was Esther. That was Esther that said that on the Instagram story. Akuna Matata. That's what you're saying. I, I never I never spoke. I've, I've not spoken to no, the girl. No, because I remember. I've got a screenshot of that. Well, she oh. deleted the post afterwards, man. She deleted the post after. I've got all the posts. But I've like, see with me, I'm, I might be gone, but I'm not gone. I'm watching everything. You understand? Mm. You know, we've all got burner accounts, bruv. They're watching me, I'm watching them. Like, look, look, nobody should start capping right now because it will just be peak and it'll be a very long day in the park. <laughs> mm. Send that to my lawyer. My lawyer's the one that contacted her, bruv. Not what was me. your lawyer's thoughts? What was your lawyer's thoughts on all this? <sighs> Boy, my lawyer's thoughts was very much like, obviously, the questions are going to go like, what, what's this 18 girls thing? They're going to ask you the honest questions. You know what I'm saying? Um, mm. And that's why you, what we call um, word of counsel. You speak to them in confined space. You give them a full disclosure. Listen, let me make it clear to you. Mm -hmm. I'm not a squeaky clean guy. I've never, ever, 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 ever. Nah, I've never, ever, ever tried to come out like I'm holier than thou. But I am definitely not what you're trying mm. to make me out to be. Trust me mm. on that. So, obviously, once I did that with my lawyer now, you know the fees. Things are expensive, bro, especially with the tax inflations. It costs money. You've got to have money. So, I did what I needed to do. Do you understand? And those around me that, you know, showed me the support and love were there. And this is what makes me think, like, raw. if, like, you know, like, okay, let me just make it, let me make it clear to you. When you're going through private law, everything is, you don't get no legal aid. Do you understand? Everything is private. Mm. You have to pay for it. I'm the one that's taking it to them now. Yeah. You have to pay for it. So you know how much money I've spent. I've shown you receipts. As you don't have to, like, you've seen receipts. I don't have to lie. And the reason I show you receipts is because I don't want you to be, I don't want people to come up on this space like last time talking shit. Like there's one idiot that came on last time talking, you. You didn't stick it on him, bruv. I'll stick it on you, bruv. I'll stick it on you. You don't know nothing. That's the same you that got exposed later on for talking shit. I'll stick it on you, bruv. There's no one that's going to rap for me. Do you understand? And when my, when my family... I... When my mum's mm -hmm. my home, when my family home is at, at, at threat, bruv, I'll wipe out anybody. I don't care. I'm that kind of person. I do not care. 
But, but okay, but Mark, mm. Mark, Mark, why did mm. they only bring this up now? Why haven't why why is it only them. now that they I swear, I swear they're in relationships. I swear, I swear they're doing their thing. Why are you watching what I'm doing for me? I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. You got a boyfriend, you got your thing, you're doing nice, you're doing good. God bless you. Do your thing. You want to do it for clout because your career's dead, you're looking for a new direction. Uh, you want to be an advocate for bullshit. Don't don't waste your time doing things for, for the purpose of what? Clout. You should be ashamed of yourself. Mm. Real talk. Let me not let me I'm... let me let me make you dig something, yeah. I remember when this first came out, yeah. Let me not even bullshit or cap to anybody. When this first came out, bro, my spirit left my body. You know that's it was mad. Like I literally, I'll never forget it. My spirit left my body. I said, "Raw." Some people are mad. I was, I was, I was gone. I was taken aback. I can't lie. I had to regather my thoughts, and it really didn't hit home until I went out. Um, must have been just a Westfield to pick up an order. I couldn't mm. watch. No, I couldn't watch nobody's face. I was just doing my own thing. I just knew that, yo, anyone talks smoke, they get mashed. Simple. Like I'm not, I'm not on no talking to you. Chat oh shit to me. I'll, I'll clear you out right there and then. But like I said, right, not... guys, guys, everyone, tweet all your thoughts on the hashtag. Uh, retweet this space and then follow me on all my socials. I right, go mm. on, Carol. Like I said, I'm not a bad guy, but you gotta remember, yeah. Some like, bro, I'm getting messages from idiots. Oh, I'm gonna kill you. I'm going to moist you. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. I'm like, all right, internet gangster. I pray you see that. When you see me in a whole 17 stone, I ain't no pussy, but I'll lay you out cold. And okay. I was on that. I was on that. You put my life at threat, bro. So what was your family saying when they saw everything come out? Because I'll, I'll be honest, like, no. this whole campaign that they made, bro, it was international. Like, the whole world, the whole black community, even people in America. So, yeah, um, do you know like, what? It was, it was, it was global. Like, it was a lot. Crazy? It was a lot. I can't lie. Like, I mean, do you know what? Yeah, funny enough, my mum was kind of calm. My mum was just like, my mum was calm. Mm. But um, everyone was calm. Like, the way me and my family run, it's like, my family are very close knit, but they're very, they're not like, how can I say, we're, we're, you know, we're Nigerian, isn't it? We're, where we're from in Nigeria, we're very humble people. Mm. I'm probably the loudest one. Um, mm. So everyone was just checking on my welfare. Do you understand? Mm. And, um, a lot of people, surprisingly, a lot of people who I didn't really expect to check on me, checked on me. And a lot of idiots who want to jump on the bandwagon and because they want girls to like them. You know how they move? Yeah. Oh yeah. I'm. I'm. I don't support him. But if you're moist, because the amount of shit I know what, about like you. like Michael Modern? Like Michael Modern? Like what? No, 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 no. If I had a problem with Michael Modern, I'm more than mad enough to tell him that. I don't understand what Michael did. What he did. Like me and him are cool. Like he's got his own life. I've got my own life in it. I don't really understand why he did that. Maybe he got some um, backlash or something like that for maybe not taking it so seriously. You'd have to ask him. I can't speak for another man, but. I can't really give you an understanding of that. Like, I don't understand that myself, but it's cool. Mm. All right. So when Esther spoke about the 18 women involved and the investigation was going on, like, what happened with all that? You're asking me? I don't know. Yeah. 18 yeah. women? Bro, like, what my thing is, like... To this say, day, has anyone, has the police, bro, the court, I'm, anyone, I'm the lawyer, have I'm they not, heard I'm not of these women a, and, not, and the I'm investigation? Not, I'm not talking to you from a blower. I'm not talking to you from inside the pen. I'm not sharing a bunk, you know. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm not, I'm not in a, like, 18 women, bro. Like, really? For time, yeah, I don't know if anybody noticed, but my DP on my Instagram was 18 with bullet holes. Because I was just like, bruv, like, if you're going to talk shit, let me just make mockery of it, because it's bull crap. 18 girls. Yeah, I know. I know, I know, I know I've been a bad right. dude. Hold on, yeah. hold on. I know I've been a bad dude, yeah. But really? What, 18 girls are going to come for you? Are they disabled? What, do they not have mouths? Mm. Did you become Mother Teresa to, to the beckoning call? Why has nobody asked her to show that? What investigation, bro? What investigation? 
What do you mm. think this is? What do you think man's R. Kelly out here, bro? What do you think this is? <laughs> bro, I don't, I'm not industry. I've never tried to be. We, I'm, t- I'm trying to let people know, yeah, that you shouldn't be in it. Shut your mouth, bro. Focus on your own career. <laughs> <laughs> all right. No, uh, okay. All right. Respectfully. All right, cool. Do you know what it is, yeah? There, there was something that she said. Um, Carl, I know I've mentioned it already, but like she said, bro. She claimed she said that you was on Claire's law, but I'm pretty sure you would have been convicted like of some sort of crime. Bro, like, l- l- let me tell you, let me tell you, have you been convicted you of a free. crime or not? Let me tell you for free. Yeah. Is that something that we don't know? Bro, the only thing you know, anybody that knows me, yes, I've been in prison. It's not a big, it's not, a, it's not a secret. Do you understand? Um, mm. But what I've been in prison for, like, it, it doesn't affect me. But I have a very good job. I'm very well paid. I'm very good in what I'm doing. Do you understand? Now, I don't know who, like, bro, you know what it is? People are just gullible. Go and do your research. Do you know Claire's law? Bro, come on. Let me make Mark's law for all the girls that took shit. Like, you know, let me join some charities and stuff. For any guy that's been slandered, you know, you know, donate £10 a month for legal, pro- pro- you know, procedures. Girls make mm. some, there's some girls, not all girls. There are some girls out there that make some wild accusations and they're not held accountable for it mm. they're not held accountable for it and the uk are so oh they're so they're so held back on they, yeah, he did that, he you did mean that you shit. mean they turn a blind eye they turn a blind yeah, eye yeah he did so. that shit i don't really i'm giving this too much energy and i promised myself so i said no let me call him down but my passion is always always nah, overtake yourself man you've got your yeah. voice and it's express it yeah, but like real talk, it's just one of them situations where eighteen girls, bro, come on, that's a serial monster. Okay, what, the you question know what? I, I want to you is, this, uh, me, hold on, hold on. The question I want to send to you is this: Did nobody see when I put yo Trend Central, aka used to be Back Chat Channel, send me up on this thing? Let's all sit down and talk. When I really wanted to talk, yeah. They went on it. They went on piss. Content, 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 content. You're not on piss. But but okay, let's play devil's advocate here though. But mm. him having you on there, wouldn't that be good for content? Bro. That would have been he... good for content, especially with everything. No, that no, was no, going no, 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 no. If you're gonna if you're gonna chat shit, yeah, about someone, there's always gonna be three sides of the story. Mm. He said her side, or let's just say their side, my side, and the truth. Mm. Why could why was it, you know, certain individuals on this say, oh, I'm scared of him, and the other was like, I'm the wrong one. Wrong who? I beg, was you not in the party one time getting slapped up by some guy because you were running your mouth? <laughs> or is it, should I start exposing people? <laughs> was you not in a party oh, not too dude. long ago, a well-known establishment getting slapped up by someone because you were running your mouth? Because all you do is know to talk shit. Bro, when when my daughter, like, like this, let me not even get into that, but there's certain things that touch my spirit separately that I said, nah, you are going to see a different side of me. What do you, what do you, expect? they expected me to sit down and crumble up. And I'm telling you, this is just the beginning, bro. You saw what happened today? I mm. promise, Listen, I know what obviously life. you told me. I know what's going on today. It's a treacherous yeah. No, 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 no. That, that's part one. I promise oh, you. Oh, mate, it's a treacherous day, but... Listen. I promise you, yeah. You see with me, I'm like a bad rash. If you're going to talk crap on me, make sure it's factual because I'm going to keep coming for you. Remember last time I said to you, I'm coming, but I didn't want to say mm. much. If I said it, it's already happened. Mm. Because it's okay. gone on for too long where girls, like, people just chat shit and no one's held accountable for it. It's not nice. Okay. Mm. All right, cool. Everyone, everyone tweet all your thoughts on the hashtag, Harsh Reality Gnosis. Retweet this space. And then also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, uh, TikTok, and subscribe to my YouTube as well. But tweet all your thoughts on the hashtag and retweet this space. All right, cool. Mark, I'm going to ask you this one, innit? Yeah, but uh, basically, I've heard from the grapevine that you know, basically Esther. Or well, to be honest, I'm not even going to ask you that. Let me ask you this first. Mm. 
I'm pretty sure everyone knows this as well. They've all seen it. But Estos, you also brought up your your family. Yo, and, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, mm. I heard that there was a uh, you know other situations. And she brought up some, like, she brought up your brother and that. Like, she, so you know what, what in, her, in her defense, yeah, she didn't bring up my brother. What she did is, she, see, people are dumb. Dumb, dumb, dumb. She tried to play a chess move and it just backfired. It's, it's, it's going to look very stupid in a few days. You'll know why soon enough. Just keep, mm. just keep your eyes open. You went and put my name on it. You didn't spell my name right. Then you could, I can confirm that the person I, I don't talk on spelling right now, please. Don't talk on I, know, spelling. I know, I know, I know. Right now, I can't even talk. But you know what it is? I, I was just typing very fast. Anyway, mm. long story cut short, when you put someone's name up there, what do you think people are going to do? It's like a treasure chest. Then everyone's going to start looking for gold. Mm. I'm not going to lie. Yeah? Like, you know, my brother's home, you understand. And I was upset because I think to myself, my, that's my little brother, do you understand? And mm. if you if you're close to me, you'll know what he went through mentally. And like he's a, he's a, he's a lovely guy. He's just the circumstances were were very um, unfortunate. Mm. You know, pro rugby player, talented boy, gifted, and he just got himself in some bad situation. And he's 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 a better man for it now. Do you understand? And when that happened, I was like, yo, like obviously people started doing the two, and that was all to, that was down to the contribution of this individual, but that's mad that that really upset me you understand and everybody was comparing and that was a that was a really really tough time for my family if you're gonna come for me come for me you do understand make sure your shit sticks though because don't throw stones if you live in a glass house because i know that certain people have got some dirty little secrets in their own closet you understand Mm. Mm. okay you know what boom um now i heard I heard, yeah, mm. from a reasonable source. Mm. This source has even sent me a newspaper article. I'm pretty sure you've seen it yourself. I don't know what you're talking about. I need to go on. There was a link, a link. There's a link. I don't think mm. it was an article, but it was a link. Mm. Um, and basically, it was um, about her brother. He, her brother's been arrested for, for rape. He went prison for rape. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, I think I heard about that still. Mm. Yeah. Mm. See? And, um, mm. I, I mm. I, you know what it is? I'll be honest with you. A I numerous amount about... of people have sent me this link as well. Do you I'm know what it is? I've heard sure about you... that. I've heard about that, but that's not my place to talk on. Do you get me? I'm going to re- I'm gonna remain graceful in that situation. Do you understand? Um, so, yeah. So you you didn't like help him get a job in any of that like when he came out of prison. <laughs> yeah, I'm not saying nothing, bro. <laughs> bro, you didn't help him get a job. When Brother helped him. Like, uh, listen, he's a he's a, yeah. I did what I didn't need to do in it. You know I'm saying. All right, so you you actually got him a job as well. Mm, yeah, I set him up. Mm. All right, cool. Um, boy. Now, I'll be honest. I see why you were saying, let me be quiet and wait when you first came on. Mm. Obviously, you didn't tell me too much. And a lot of listeners, they, they, they was like, what's he on about? Like, why is he coming with this mysterious approach? Like, don't worry, soon you'll find out. Because um, obviously today... You know, you had your your your. You know, you went to court today. You had your hearing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um. So, how did that go? And did they attend the hearing? Was they there? Have you heard uh, from them? No, they didn't attend. Uh, I think it was a situation where. Excuse me. Hold on. Um. Yeah. What happened is, um, after the cease and desist letter. Mm. Um, they was I, I said you well days lot think it's a joke. Like I'm mm. not gonna you're not gonna chat shit and think it's gonna be left there, innit? Um mm. and yeah, so obviously my barrister or my lawyer was instructed to take the situation further and so we did. Um now my thing is like I said, there, there, there's protocols you gotta follow and mm. We've all seen how easy it is to be 
in consent, like in, in content to be in slander. And there's just different things you can be done um, done for in media. You have to be mad careful, mad mm. careful. We, you know, people people don't even realize the forms of entertainment they're in. They just think it's about opening their mouth and then yeah, ha ha ha, keep it going. You know, I'm not trying to be industry. Do you understand? Um, if anything, if you don't like my opinion, change the page, like change the channel. Don't listen to me. Do you understand? Yeah. Um, but don't don't make it your job to like sending me messages and talking shit in my DMs. It's not going to do nothing to me. It's just if you were really that brave, you like yeah. I said, I would love for you to have a discussion with me face to face and let's see what happens. But I think I did what I needed to do to show to show them that I'm not on your stupid kick cat and mouse game. You do that shit mm. for content, content, content. We'll see where content gets you. Mm. Okay. So why has Andy facilitated all of this? Andy is a businessman. Andy is someone who I classify as Esther's friend. Esther, they've grown up together. They've worked with together. I came into the setup a bit later than them. So it was, um, I was always the outsider. <clears throat> and mm-hmm. to be fair, I mean, I've had discussions with Andy when this whole trailer thing came out. I, I tried to reason with him. Tried mm-hmm. to talk to him. I'm like, bro, what are you doing? But then Andy mm-hmm. is someone who I don't feel classifies anything. He doesn't have any boundaries. Mm. And um, I, you know, I'm not gonna go and I don't know him and I don't want to know him. But like, like do your thing in it. But he definitely thinks I'm a pussy. So because I definitely think them them lot have given him that probably mindset. Oh, he's not gonna do nothing. Don't worry, bro. I always say there's always one day, every day for the teeth and it one day for the owner. So we'll see where content, content, content gets. You're in enough mm. trouble already, bro. So I don't really need to say much on that. <laughs> I heard. Now, this is what I've heard. I've heard apparently he's got a court case for fraud. Bruv, his whole set setup is fraud, bruv. All he does, like, I don't even want to, like, the thing is, I don't want to be talking like a chatty patty, bruv, but he's an idiot, man. Like, like that's what I said, don't throw stones if you live in a glass house, bruv. Like, nah, because he's got a court case for fraud coming up. And that's public knowledge, know. bro. I think that's been put out there. I don't really know, but. You know, one thing I'll say, the only issue I have with him is don't use my life for content, bro. You didn't even give me the, like, like what the fuck? Like, the amount of shit I actually know about this guy is wild. And I'm actually saying it now. Like, it's dirty. It's, the list is long. But I'm not going to be drawn into that. Your day will come. In fact, your day is coming. Let me not even say that. Your day is coming. It's not even going to come. It's coming. Do you feel as if he's had a agenda against you for no, quite a no, while? No, 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 there's no personal agenda. Like we're not boys like that. If he was beef, I would have we would have rocked and I would have snocked him out cold. Like I've said that. Like there's no, there's no um, what do you call it? Wicked and bad around here, bruv. I don't do all of that, bruv. If, if it was something like that, we would have dealt with it there and then. It's not, it's not. I'm not that guy, innit? Don't be twisted. Mm. Don't be fooled. And think because we're all kaka and kiki, and like if you want to check, if you want to test, man, step to me in it. You mm. did it behind closed doors, hiding like you're a coward, bruv. Like, you're a clown. I don't, mm. I don't okay. need to do gimmicks. Like your your day will come in it. Like that's like I said, I don't need to do nothing to you. So do you, do you think all the controversy around back chat has not favoured as the show isn't hitting like it was before? It hasn't really favoured them. I don't know. Look, look one, one thing I'll say about Andy. Andy's, like I said, he's a businessman, right? He's... No, but what I'm... No, do you know what it is? What I mean by that question is, obviously, when it all came out, he used the controversy as a rollout. Well, to be honest, they exposed it all on the show. And the controversy helped the whole YouTube channel. As I said, people all over the globe was tuned in to this. They all saw it. Give him his props where he's due. Look, yeah. we, we, have, we we as consumers, look, we're not we're all here today. Let's 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 take a, a step back. We're because no here. one's really talking about the new back chat that they've got on. They've got new. I don't even think that's even now. going on anymore. I don't even give it. I don't mm. think it's even going on no more. Let me just give it factual, straight facts. Yeah, mm. we are all here in this conversation today because we all like gist. Mm. We want to hear 
you understand? Andy mm. is the biggest manipulate monopolized guy on that. He knows how to monopolize, restructure things for his benefit. That's quite a smart tactic. We mm. love drama. We love uh, controversy. We love entertainment, and mm. he has found a niche. So. Mm. I, I'm not. I'm not even like, like I said. I'm not even trying to beef the guy. I don't even give a fuck about him like that. But one thing I will say for free is that he saw an opportunity and he capitalized on it straight. He saw views mm. because let's face it, the first person that spoke about me years ago is because I never did anything. That's why people were chatting shit. Gossip, people gossip, man. I heard this. I heard that. Okay, we've all got skeletons to some degree. Not all of them are true. And I've not, I've not got all the hours and the minutes in the day to be explaining myself to everybody because I don't care. Mm. But because of the sensitivity of this thing, I thought, you know what? They fucking hit me on the wrong day. That's it. The wrong day. 18 okay, years. so... Mm. Oh, damn. Okay, damn. so... You know what? I just want to ask you again... Um, you know what? I'm going to ask you this, right? Because mm. uh, I know you touched on Bianca earlier on, but I'm going to mm. just ask you this. Mm. Um, she made a wild accusation that you tried to throw acid out of face. Bro, you tried bro, to kidnap bro. her. Get, uh, okay. she, uh, There's no such thing as tried. Did, you know, did, well, this is the accusations that she's made. She said that you tried. Uh, she regret uh, them. You she claimed, regret she them. 